and do your maintenance. Yep, Trophy for weather time now. Florida citrus crops suffering this year. Warm, dry weather causing too much fruit to grow. A lot of it is falling off the trees. Farmers also dealing with something called citrus greening disease. It leaves the fruit sour and unusable and eventually kills the infected tree. How we get from that, that now to John news. Milan. <laughs> you know, they're also getting some blasts of cold air down there in Florida, too. So they had a, actually had a hard freeze warning in the northern part of the state uh, over the weekend. Now, winter storm warnings. Uh, we were all under a winter storm warning earlier today, with the exception of Fond du Lac and Sheboygan counties. But now the old, there's only four counties, Jefferson, Walworth, Racine, and Kenosha under the winter storm warning. Starts at 6 o'clock tomorrow morning, runs till Tuesday at midnight, uh, Tuesday night at midnight, I should say. Winter weather advisories now for Dodge, Waukesha, and Milwaukee counties. Uh, everybody else has no advisory. You only see somewhere in the 1 to 3 inch range, like Fond du Lac County and Washington, Ozaki, and Sheboygan counties, but three to five inches from areas of Dodge County into Waukesha County and Milwaukee County. And you can see the biggest snows, again, to the south, five to eight inches if you're traveling to, north, to the southwest part of the state. That area could see 10 inches of new snow. Here is Viper Radar, one low pressure system just moving out of the Dakotas now. That's the Alberta Clipper. That's moving to the south and east. It'll connect with a second low pressure system to our south, and that's where the accumulating snow will be coming from. We have just a little bit of very light snow on the radar right now. Uh, that's around Burlington, portions of Walworth County into Racine, Kenosha County, but this is very, very light snow and it will not accumulate much cold air today and cold air right through tomorrow high pressure uh, bringing that in let's check our map of uh, highs today 27 in La Crosse and the Twin Cities 31 Chicago 30 in Milwaukee temperatures right now holding in the upper 20s all in all locations with 27 in Waukesha 29 in Racine so as those storms merge and this clipper moves to the south and east you can see the heavy snow band mainly southwest Wisconsin to about the Chicago area by Wednesday we just see northerly winds and maybe the chance for a couple of snow showers east northeast winds and they will be brisk tomorrow 32 in Milwaukee 29 Green Bay 30 in Madison with snow everywhere across the state but again the heavy snow is southwest Wisconsin cloudy snow develops after midnight flurries are possible though before that east winds and 28 degrees could see an inch on the ground between about five and eight o'clock in the morning cloudy windy with snow Milwaukee County gets about one to three inches of snow less to the north more to the south and those winds stay strong out of the east northeast windy snow additional inch uh, tomorrow night 24 degrees and on wednesday just variable clouds a few snow showers possible winds lighter high 34. here's your storm team four seven day planner we're looking at essentially 35 degrees on thursday and uh mostly cloudy sky some sunshine on friday 38 saturday and sunday temperatures back into the 40s steve and courtney into the 40s i said into the 40s on saturday and sunday <laughs> Are you trying to get people to forgive you i guess so keep working okay <laughs>